Hey, what's up? It's Brizzo, and this is Uncharted 2 Crushing Difficulty and Treasures Walkthrough. Uh, chapter 3, Borneo, Part 1. So, uh, Chloe has set up a bunch of these bombs here that you have to detonate to uh, get that bad guy's guys away from wherever he is so you can go in and investigate whatever knowledge he has and it's also the start of some really heavy combat oh, this level has let's see four treasures um, some of them are actually hidden incredibly well And when you get up here, it's uh, your first real combat opportunity. Now there's two ways to do this. You can either go in loud or you can go in quiet. And I recommend quiet. So there's gonna these two guys up ahead are gonna split up. One guy's gonna go left. One guy's gonna go right. Hang out here on the right and wait until the guy comes over here and he turns his back. Uh, it's going to be a little bit. <laughs> Alright, once he moves. Silent takedown. Double back around and take out the other guy. Now, if you go in there and you fire shots, there's going to be like four or five guys that you're going to take out. But if you go in quiet, it's just these two. You also notice that little uh, ninja symbol. Uh, it's a carryover from the first game, except this game does a little different. Uh, You'll normally, sometimes the guys will drop stuff that they won't, like instead of dropping, when they won't drop grenades, they will, or instead of dropping like a, an AK-47, they'll drop you uh, uh, an Uzi or something. It'll always have that little ninja symbol next to them. This is my first death edit for the game. Uh, I went in here, now you can do most of this stealth. There's these guys on the bottom floor, on the ground, and then there's two guys up top. And where I am now, you could have pulled that guy with that log, but the problem is that guy on the top. It's tough to get to him without being seen, but you can do it if you want, but I decided to screw it. And the reason I decided that was that there's two of you. Uh, Sully's carrying the... Uh, I forget what it's called, but it's a magnum. So he's, he's going to do a good bit of damage to anybody that he gets a bullet into. So this isn't too complicated a firefight. The only reason I died is because I got caught out in the open. Kind of like that. And one of the improvements over this game is when you're blind firing, you have like the uh, the shotgun reticle on the screen, so you can see better where you're firing, and it makes it easier to uh, to kill guys while blind firing. Looks like we can swing across there. See if I can find another way <laughs> Again. So there's just uh, two guys for now. It's uh, I think it's impossible to take these guys out quietly. So 
So use whatever weapons you have, get the job done. Now just be careful because the reason I got killed was uh, a guy dropped down from that right side and came from behind, so... Uh, just be careful, keep... Um, let go of your left trigger every once in a while so you can pan the camera around and get a look at your surroundings. Alright, so this area is clear, there's just another treasure to pick up, and that's it for part one, I'll see you in part two.